What's going on my fellow ARC players? This is Data. Hope you're doing well. This is how we're going to be taming with the flyer. In this video I'm going to be going over catching wild dinos with different flyers. I'm going to be using a Quetz in this particular example and once we catch the dino I'm after then I'll show you the taming pen as I drop it in there. All right, I'm gonna use a spyglass. I think I saw a Sarko 135 over here in the swamp close to the green obelisk. They spawn here quite often, usually in pairs. And I think there's one down here somewhere. I just need to spot it. There it is, it's in the trees right now. So I'm gonna wait till it moves out of the trees to get the best advantage to grab it and get out of here with it as safely as possible. Running around in the swamp is definitely a dangerous proposition. So many wild dinosaurs that are willing to eat you alive if you let them. I'm not going to let them do that today. Alright, where's this thing at? I think it moved. Finding it is usually the hardest part. Or getting a nice high level one is one of the hardest things or the most difficult aspects in this particular process. Let's see, where's he at? He or she, there it is. I don't know if that's a male or female. Let's take a look. I think it was a 135 though. There it is, close to the shore. Yes, indeed. All right, I'm gonna get ready. I think it was heading towards the beach over there or the shoreline. Yes, indeed, it's getting out of the water. You don't wanna do this over the water because it may, you may end up popping off of your tame if you hit the water. These birds don't like water. All right, he's going back on shore. I'm going to swoop down with the quets and grab him. All right, we got the grab and the go. There he is. Usually they do not attack. They just hang along for the ride. I'm going to head over towards our tribe's taming pen at the green obelisk on the island. Drop them into the taming pen and begin to trank them. Give them the kibble and that should be end of story. So let's see how this goes. All right, this is fairly close to the swamp on the east side. You can do these with any birds that grab creatures. They all have different creatures they can grab. The pteranodons, argies, quetzals, even a wire wyvern if you've been on scorched earth you can grab pretty much anything you cannot grab rexes spinos brontos so this is going to be for some of the smaller creatures you can grab carnos trikes medium-sized dinos like that all right there's our base to the left I'm going to spin it around, get in the correct direction, head towards the behemoth gate, line myself up with the center, and press the drop, and it will fall in. All right, we're going to take a look at the trap itself here in just a moment. It's a dual-sided trap for easy taming and safe taming. All right, there you can see the sarco is inside. It's not going anywhere. And why don't I explain the trap itself? I have, we have this one in a safety zone without too many creatures that spawn up here. So when you land next to it to get into the trap itself, it'll be safe. It has four dinosaur gates on either side, three on the bottom, and a behemoth gate up at the top with door frames in the middle dividing it directly in half so whichever half your dino falls into just enter the trap from the other side and you should be pretty safe to begin tranking it. Alright I'm going to land the quets. It is on the behemoth side of the trap and I'm going to head in on the opposite side of the behemoth gate. Make sure I'm set up with the trank darts. Alright, 
in we go. All right, that center wall is gonna protect us. Let's see if I can get it. Start out with a headshot. I don't know. It's got itself kind of buried in there. It's taking a little nap here. All right, let's go with that side. The higher level, the long neck that you have, the more percentage point damage, the more percentage points it does with the trank darts. So you may not need to do as many trank darts if you have a decent long neck rifle. All right, it's down for the count. All right, all I have to left is to drop some kibble in it, narcotics, and we're gonna tame this bad boy. 135 Sarko. Always looking for the 150s, but sometimes 135s can have some better stats for breeding. All right, that'll do it. Hope you guys test that out. It's a pretty good trap. We'll see you in the next video. Have a great day and bye-bye.